Hi, I'm Dr. K. Patel. In this video, we're going to use sclerotic scatter with the slit lamp to look at the cornea. Sclerotic scatter is a technique used to visualize corneal abnormalities such as foreign bodies, infiltrates, or edema. It's a type of indirect illumination that takes advantage of total internal reflection of light within the cornea. Light entering the cornea from the side is reflected within the cornea and exits around the limbus, creating a glow. Light can only break out of the cornea if it hits an irregularity, such as swelling or a foreign body, in which case it appears as a haze or a pinpoint of light against the dark pupil background. With the room lights low, to maximise contrast, focus a sharp, bright optic section on the centre of the cornea. With the illumination system, coming from the temporal side. Lock the slit lamp in place so that the observation system will continue to be focused on the central portion of the cornea. Decouple the illumination and observation systems. In the case of the SLD701, this is done by loosening the dial and rotating the illuminating tower. Position the slit on the temporal limbus. Increase the width of the beam to a parallel pipe and turn up the brightness. The magnification should be low to medium. Due to total internal reflection, the light hitting the edge of the cornea is emitted around the edges of the cornea as a circular glow. But the microscope still remains focused on the central cornea. This is a keratoconic eye with a history of radial keratotomy and corneal cross-linking, and now has had corneal injury causing central corneal edema. Don't forget to recouple the slit lamp before moving on to the rest of your slit lamp routine. Thanks for watching. I'm Dr. Kaya Patel. And if you'd like this video, come back to watch more. Or you can learn more at Topcon Healthcare University.